friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. Thanks for spending some time with me today, guys. Um, my name is Valerie. Um, so today, guys, we're doing a very small, um, what I've been warming, Project Use It Up wax edition. Because I got my Bring Back My Bars in. And uh, when those came in, uh, everything came out of my warmers. And the only thing I've been warming since then is um, my Bring Back My Bar Bars. My Bring Back My Bar Bars. Um, because uh, they are going to go live on my website on June 1st. Um, so check out my uh, video uh, for Bring Back My Bars. I will, um, I'll try to link it below. And, um... But if not, just go to my channel and check it out. Um, there's 20 scents, and out of the 22, I've only tried before. So 18 were new scents to me. And I did first sniffs, guys, so go check that video out. Um, and there's some really good stuff in there, all right? So I don't have a whole lot today um, because, like I said, I cut this short. And so I just had a few days of warming, so uh, let's get into it. And, uh, yeah. Uh, so guys, um, let me look here how I did this one. Okay, so I did warm some of this uh, Sensational Sweet Berry Cupcake. All right, I had gotten two of them. I did not like this because of that really deep note, uh, like bakery note, that mean really deep note. Like it was between... Um, let's say your cake or cupcakes are in your oven and it's between being done and being burnt in between there, that overdoneness. That's was what I was really getting out of this. So this time when I warmed it, I did a mix. I went ahead and added some better homes and gardens, vanilla buttercream right in the warmers with this. I think I did, um, this is not in project use it up, but I think I did three cubes of this. And then I think I did, yeah, I had two cubes left in this one, and then I did another cube. So three cubes throughout my open concept with three cubes of this added into it. It was still pretty deep. Um, it was better, but it was still pretty deep. So I just want to work through this and get it out of my out of the collection. I don't want to repurchase this again because, um, I don't know, maybe I'd find maybe another something else I can mix with it. But I don't want to buy something and then just uh, to have it. I don't want to buy something and then have to mix it, you know, knowingly. Um, it's different if I get it and then I realize, oh, I'm going to have to mix it to use it up. But I don't want to get it and think, oh, I got to have this and this to mix it in order to like it. Um, I don't want to purchase stuff like that. So I'm going to mark this off real quick. This one, I'm just, well, it's done. I did finish this one completely. So you'll see this one on my empties. Set notes, I guess I never did give you guys a set notes on them. Let me go with that go that route real quick. Oh, they fell. Sorry guys, I'm really tired today. So uh top notes are raspberry, strawberry. Oh, I can't see them. Can't see, can't talk, can't do nothing today. <laughs> Sorry. Uh top notes are raspberry, strawberry, lemon, mid notes are blackberry, berry preserves. Accord, berry Preserves Accord, Vanilla Cheesecake Accord, Vanilla Cream Basis Cheesecake Accord, Butter Vanilla Bean, Brown Sugar, and Graham Cracker Base. Whew. There's a lot going on in that one, and it just isn't enough to make it good. I think if it wasn't so deep and almost that super doneness, it would be okay. So let me get this one marked off too. So I've only got, what, five more cubes to get through this one. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's going to go back into Project Use It Up. So there you have that one, guys. All right, the next one I used was Flower Shop by Scentsy. And this one has notes of, I got this from Bring Back My Bar last last summer, last June. Creamy Lemon and Jasmine. Mm. This is very, very pretty. I love this scent. And the reason I didn't club it, and the reason I'm trying to get rid of it is because it just does not perform. It did not perform well for me. Now, I used this in my bedroom. I did uh, two cubes 
in my bedroom, as you can see, those are not marked off, so I've not used those. Um, and it performed better. It did perform better. I could smell it better. It was there longer than what it was before. Um, it probably got stronger from sitting for almost about a year. Um, so uh, I did like it, but it's still just, it was just uh, disheartening that it just, it's a beautiful scent, but it just doesn't throw well. And it didn't last very long either. I mean, it was like several hours, like one day, and it was done. So, flower shop. Um, you can't repurchase it, but if I could repurchase it, no, I would not. Because just the performance isn't very good. And I kind of noticed this time, this kind of has the same... Not exact, but it's it's got some similarities to... Um, oh, I'm getting... I'm getting marker all over me, guys. <laughs> some super, uh, some super, some similarities to Summer Holiday. I kind of like the base notes of it, like the base of it kind of smells similar to that in my book, but Summer Holiday performs a whole lot better. So, Flower Shop, I got three more cubes to use. Um, I'm going to use them in my bedroom and I'll enjoy it while it lasts, but um, it's always, I always want to warm this on a day that I'm going to be in that room more. Um, so that I can enjoy it. All right, the next one was Apple Cherry Strudel. And I did finish this one, guys. Okay, I did three cubes in my bedroom because this one, I was a, it was a problem child, too. I warmed it out here, and it just, I couldn't hardly smell it. I really did not, I, I could barely get it, and... So I thought, ah, oh, we'll try it in my bedroom. I did three full cubes of it in my bedroom. And uh, I smelt it a little better. I did perform a little bit better. But I still did not get a lot out of it. And it was just a few hours and I it was gone. I couldn't smell it anymore. So uh, apple cherry stew. I know a lot of people love this. But this one, I know, it doesn't seem to pick up. Now, I don't normally have problems picking up apple, and I normally don't have problems picking up cherry. But this one, for some reason, I do. So, I'm not going to repurchase this again because just the fact, even after it's sitting for so such a, you know, several months, it still did not perform great for me. So, uh, yeah, that one is not going to be repurchased either. I don't think, you know... Sometimes may, you know, you think, no, I'm not going to. And then, okay, I'm going to try it. And then you do try it and try it again. And I don't know. I might purchase another bar and work, check it out again. But I don't know. I, I really doubt it. There's too many other apple cherry scents that I like that I can get. So, yeah, this one is done. Okay, and the last one, guys, um, I said this was going to be very short. <laughs> Um, was Scentsy Pink Lemon Water. I got this in the Consultant um, Scent of the Month kit. And so I had lots of bars of these. I still have lots of bars of these. When I warmed it last summer, it was like last spring. I, it was, I think, like the second scent of the month that I got in a consultant kit. I think it was only my second month as a consultant. But anyway... I did not like this. I did not like it at all. The scent notes. Let me see if I even have the scent notes on here. Yes, I do. Rose water, lemon, and sugar. And it was mainly rose. That's mainly all I got was like rose, rose, straight up rose. A little bit of sweetness, but and it did not perform well. It did not throw super great. It was like, you know, a couple hours. It was over and it was done with. And, um... Yeah, I, I was not impressed. I hadn't warmed it since. I've let, been letting it sit, sit in my closet for a while. And so I decided, okay, I need to use that up. So I thought, well, I'm going to get that out and I'm going to warm it with something else. So I combined it with Happy Home, Sensational's Happy Home. And the set notes on this is Candied, Candied Orange, I think. Let's see here. Candied Orange, Sparkling Lemon. Oh, Candied orange, sparkling lemon, lime, vanilla, cookies, sugar crystals, and buttercream. And um, this is supposed to be bakery. And it does have kind of a bakery scent to it. But I had been warming the, these three cubes 
out in my open cast up first for like a day and it was really good and then I thought I'm going I'm gonna throw these in there too I didn't throw them in together I did alternating warmers instead and and I'll tell you what guys this too this combo was really nice this has a very citrusy lemon scent to it from what I'm getting like a, a lemon lemony scent um and this one was lacking the lemon scent so bringing this these two together really i felt was wonderful because it brought the lemon out and it toned this rose down a little bit and these lasted for several days then in my warmers you know they just kept going and going and going and going so i'm kind of not i'm kind of really liking this pink lemon water so i didn't do all of this in my open concept though i did three cubes. I did one cube in my, I did one cube at each one of my spare bedrooms. So that's two. And then I did another cube in my uh, spare bathroom. And then I did three cubes out here in the open concept. And I'll tell you what, with between all three of them, it just, even the ones that were not mixed with this just kept going. And it, and it was like the scent was so much better. I think just letting it sit for almost a year again, or for a year, really, really brought this to mature maturation its maturity and it uh performed pretty good it was it was really good it's really nice i'm really considering um you know possibly putting this in my tub i don't know um because i did like it i did enjoy it but i have been getting more on the wavelength with florals and rose has really been something i really like i like the rose in uh Codberry dreams um, I like the rose in, in this pink lemon water. Um, there was something else that had rose in it that I really liked. I can't remember. But I'm really, you know, really enjoying that more. So, that being said, that might go in my club. And uh, that's it, guys. That's all I used. <laughs> that is it. That's all I used. So, I guess I don't need to mark this off it's it's like self satisfaction it's just like satisfaction to mark this off knowing that I have accomplished using this bar up and it's done it's over with and even though I think I like this one now who would have thought I would have thought it because when I seen it coming back in the catalog this year I was like oh why is that coming back nobody's gonna want that nobody's gonna buy that <laughs> That's what I thought. And now I'm like, hmm, I might be buying it because it's kind of good. So anyway, that is my project use up, guys, for this uh, episode. Uh, sorry it was so short, but like I said, everything came to screeching halt for bringing back my bars. So uh, I'm going to get off here. You guys have a wonderful day. I think I need to go take a nap because I am just like out of it. I'm tired and I'm exhausted. And I'm not getting anything done. And I and really want to get some things done, but it's just not happening. So, uh, you guys take care. I hope everyone's having a wonderful Memorial Day weekend. I don't know if I'll have this. I don't, yeah, I'm going to get this up. I'm going to go ahead and get this up, too. So, I'm going to do some... Uh, I had another video I did the, before this one, which was my warehouse uh, haul, sale haul. And um, I'm going to get that edited. I'm going to get this one edited, and I'm going to throw them both up. So, I hope you have a great Memorial Day weekend, guys, and um, I'll talk to you later, okay? Love you guys. Bye.